us with thee. How magnified are thy works, O Lord. In wisdom hast thou made them all. Bless the Lord, O my soul. Bless the Lord. The reading is from St. Paul's epistle to the Galatians. Wisdom hath thou set Brethren, knowing that a person is not justified by the works of the law, but through faith in Jesus Christ, even we have believed in Jesus Christ that we might be justified by faith in Christ and not by the works of the law. For by the works of the law shall no flesh be justified. But if, while we sought to be justified in Christ, we ourselves also were found sinners, is Christ then a minister of sin? God forbid, for if I build up again those things which I destroyed, I prove myself a transgressor. For I, through the law, died to the law, that I might live to God. I have been crucified with Christ, nevertheless I live, yet not I, but Christ lives in me. And the life which I now live in the flesh, I live by the faith of the Son of God, who loved me and gave himself up for me. Number 10, let us hear the Holy Gospel. Peace be to all. The reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Mark. Let us attend. The Lord said, If any man would come after me, let him deny himself and take up his cross and follow me. For whoever would save his life will lose it, and whoever loses his life for my sake and the gospels will save it. For what does it profit a man to gain the whole world and forfeit his soul? For what can a man give in return for his soul? For whoever is ashamed of me and my words in this adulterous and sinful generation, of him will the Son of Man also be ashamed when he comes in the glory of the Father with the holy angels. And he said to them, Truly I say to you, there are some standing here who will not taste death before they see the kingdom of God come to power. 